find tan 1950 to find this we should follow this method c here we have 1950 now we should check 1950 lies between which two multiples of 180 what i mean is 1950 lies between 1800 and 1980 this is 180 into 10 and this is 180 into 11 between these two numbers 1950 lies next 1950 is close to which number this is close to 1980 so in place of this we write 1980 minus 30 so this will become tan in place of this we write this 1980 minus 30 this is your step 1 next tan in place of this now we should write 11 into 180 minus 30 next here we have 180 so tan is not going to change it will remain tan and inside we get this angle 30 now the question is will we get here plus or minus to answer that we should look at the number before 180 that is 11 and 11 is odd and all the odd multiples of 180 they lie in either in the second or in the third quadrant so now to select the quadrant we should look at this symbol here we have negative that means angle lies in the second quadrant and in the second quadrant tan is negative so we should put negative so negative tan 30 is 1 by root 3 this is our answer